All right, so there's some mud daubers that have been building some pretty sweet nests in my daughter's playhouse. <clears throat> so I broke one compartment of it open from up here and uh, on the end there. And all these spiders came out. So there's the wasp, still twitching a little bit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And if you look carefully on the back, Leah, don't mind me, please. On the back of that one, you can see a little egg. And that's the egg that's going to hatch and eat these spiders. Oh, there's another one right there. Two eggs? Well, I guess they're not. Well, that one's still an egg. That one's already hatched. It looks like he's sucking them, sucking them dry already. Um, so, pretty dang cool. Daddy. Yeah, I know. There's a whole bunch of them. Pretty cool. And we got a bunch more to investigate right there. There's one right there, and there's one behind it. And then there's one over here, too. And there's one right here that, that you already broke. Yeah, well, that, yeah, I don't know who broke that one, but... Oh, let me show you the inside. See, you can see these... The span here, that's the different compartments. So it makes several different compartments with eggs in it. And um, and so the uh, it'll be each one will be packed full of spiders. So if you kill wasps, Whoa. you're letting spiders live. Dad, there's another one up there. Anyway, so I showed you the larva on the back of the spider there. Um, we kept digging and found this big larva inside this little case which was inside one of these so this larva is full grown because all the food in this case was gone so if given more time it would actually be uh, develop into a wasp and then break out of the case and, the, and then fly away and start their own Maybe wasps are these little food. egg laying process mm -hmm. so all these spiders right here are for two wasps there's an egg right there, and then there's a pupa right there. So what I'm going to do is put these in a container and see if I can keep growing the wasp so we can watch the process. That'd be real. Yeah. So we just dug out another case right here. Dad, there's another egg! And I'm going to keep that, take it to school in a container, and we'll watch it hatch with the students. All right, so one of the crazy things about um, these spiders is that they're not dead. They're just paralyzed. So I don't know if I can get one to move. Yeah, that one moved a little bit after I let go, but not much. But um, so they're paralyzed. They're not dead. I mean, spiders can go several weeks without food, and so they make great baby food because they can stay as they are paralyzed and then then they get eaten by the by the uh, wasp larva so it's gonna be cool to watch this now the, the other problem the problem we're gonna have is that the larva tend to make their cases the same size as their enclosure pushing against the side spinning a web and making their their shell so hopefully they'll still be able to do that even though they are out of their enclosures now from uh from us messing with them sorry i didn't realize it was so blurry oh well it's not one to focus